This is Thundercracker in 1884. Here with another video game review slash run through. And today on my Raspberry Pi, Retro Pi, I'm going to be playing Turtles for Turtles in Time. This is a definitive uh, SNES game. The cartridges in the box sell for hundreds and hundreds of dollars on eBay, maybe thousands if they're graded. This was an epic game. You could play it in the arcade four players, which I played through the end in the arcade many times as a kid in the 90s and have probably beaten a couple times later on in life on a console as well. It is an excellent game. Now I'm going to go to the options first to make it easy for myself. I can get it to select. All right. Okay, let's get started now. I want to try to get through this as quick as possible and see how many levels I can get through at once. So for this first level here, I'm going to go with I think he's the best for this level. Actually, hmm. yeah, do Leonardo. I felt it was best to get this one out of the way first because uh, this is just such an epic game. So many hours spent playing this. This is one game that I'm probably pretty decent at. Still haven't used any of my specials. I'm gonna save them for last. Ah, I can't believe that thing got me. I might have to use a special. I think it hurt me. That's already good. The pizza right up here. I'm gonna get it. Timing. Leonardo's a ninja master. I'm not gonna stop him. Ah, stupid old shark and foot soldier. My asshole. Pardon my French. I 
to use a special that time. It's been pretty close. Got a little hairy there for a second. This is only first level. So I, I just recently saw that on Nintendo Switch, they did a retro version of the Ninja Turtles. I think Shredder's Revenge or something like that. And in this one, you can be April O'Neil or Shredder uh, Splinter also, which is pretty radical. Splinter is a really awesome character. Okay, so we're at the end of the level here. I'm soon going to play Baxter Stockton. can't believe I missed him all those times. I better not die here and try to play Baxter Stockton. So I think Seth MacFarlane, or not Seth MacFarlane, Seth Rogen is supposed to be working on the Ninja Turtles series soon. I still haven't picked up the last room, but when I was at the... I hate these little bastards. Get out of here. there are some slight variances in, in how the, each character reacts to the buttons. It's slightly different. 
Maybe not. It would make sense that they would do something like that. Alright, Metalhead's come up here pretty soon. I better repeat, so I didn't even realize I only had one, one energy left. I think I'm going to let Leo die next time so that I can get a new character. You got to see who the next one is. Hmm. No, I guess he's a pretty good one for this, for this level too. Any of the levels that require precision, this one's a lot of precision. I'm really bad at it. I feel like the longer weapons make it easier. See if I can get my jumps down here. Sorry about that. Cord was. Ah, you're terrible at this one. I love you that I survived. Yes, pizza time. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna. I can never get these damn things. <laughs> one of the few levels I'm really bad at. more of them didn't get me. I'm not too bad at fighting or acting, but all those other parts are hard. Scrapping is pretty easy like an arms. I also really like the Rat King as a character. Not a huge fan favorite, I feel like, but I do really like the Rat King. They have the first appearance Rat King comic. Tales from the Turtles is definitely what a shoot number it is, but it's really cool. I like the artwork in the middle. I'd really like to get the first appearance of Leatherhead. I can't remember if he's in this game or not. I do like when it gets to the Turtles in Time part, when you got to fight Shredder inside the Technodrome. Uh, I don't really understand how to throw them right at that part, but I do like that. 
Oh, I do like that part. It's a, a good level. It's different. There's a lot of different uh, variety of levels in this game, which makes it pretty good. And for instance, this one, there's going to be two bosses at the end, even though there's only one of me, which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool today. I'll switch it up. All right, this isn't my favorite level either. All of these like that is. So we're up to about 15 minutes so far. After this level, I might stop it and try to continue. So you can see I shred, and you can shred through, what is that, like four, three, three levels, 15 minutes in this game. I could really go for uh, Michelangelo's special at the moment. I feel like this is a little better. And they're all, they're all the same. Yeah, they're all the same. One of the pizzas that makes us spin around could be good. So again, the new Ninja Turtles game is supposed to be looks pretty much just like this one. It's a little bit clearer graphics. Cool, I thought there was more of those little uh, spin drill guys. Spin drill laser. Guys. The thing about having two of them though is they're both kind of weak. Okay. 
Let's see if we should just tap this for it. That laser blast did not hit me so hard that it threw me up against the wall like that. Ah. That was cool. I like swarms of little things. These guys are the worst. The absolute worst thing in this game. I hate them. All you can do is just walk away, ignore them, let them try to hit you up, and they'll turn around and suffer a bunch of So, double shield on foot soldiers. So it's over and punch at the same time. You walk up to them and you push over and attack. And that's how you throw them. Taking that one point from me. Ah, got it. So I think this is where I'm going to pause it for now and stop this and we'll do a part two, a continuation, and see how long it takes for me to go through. Mm -hmm.